discrimination against women, hypocrisy against women, inequality, injustice, violence against women continues in Iran. But now the patriarchal country has crossed all the limits by attacking little girls in schools. To stop them from education, Iran is now poisoning them. An Iran minister made a shocking revelation when he said that some people in the country's holy city of Om were resorting to poisoning school girls in order to restrain education for girls. Yunus Panahi, the deputy health minister, implicitly confirmed the poisonings. However, no arrests have been made in this matter so far. So when it all has started, the poisoning of girls was started in late November amid unprecedented protests against Iran's regime over the death of Masa Amini in police custody. Since late November, hundreds of cases of respiratory poisoning have been reported among schoolgirls, mainly in all, with some needing hospital treatment. The latest incident was reported on 22nd February from all, where 15 schoolgirls were hospitalized. On February 14, angry parents had gathered outside the city's governorate to demand an explanation from the authorities. The next day, government said the intelligence and education ministries were trying to find out the cause of poisonings. Last week, Prosecutor General Mohammad Jafar Wantazari ordered a judicial probe into this incident. For many, it was suspicious that why only girls, not boys, were mainly affected by the illness. This has alarmed the entire situation. Reports in local media say this could be the work of religious extremists who want to prevent girls from attending school. The poisonings also come at a time when the Taliban in neighboring Afghanistan continue to keep schools and universities close to girls and women, effectively banning them from education. So yes, once again, these shocking incidents in Iran prove that the blatant discrimination against women continues in the patriarchal country.